Here's a quick video warning you of a brand new scam that I nearly fell for and it's going to affect sellers on every platform and without doubt some people will fall for it. So please share the heck out of this video and tag people if you know they've got a store, Etsy, Shopify or anything else. Let's go. You may need to zoom into this to see the scam and how it works in depth on Etsy. I didn't fall for it, but I nearly did. I think I'm well clued up on these scams. I'm prepared for anything. Nothing can catch me. But this one really nearly did. Let me explain. I got a message on my Etsy. Hi, I like the products. Product, any defects? Silver leaf design rings for 24 karat gold, £9.40. I replied and said, it's made from junk scrap metal. There are supposed to be defects. I'm not a jeweler. I have tried to purchase your product, but I am asked to enter your email. This is the first time I've done this. Please write it down. Okay. And they sent me a screenshot. And I thought, secure transaction confirmation. You need the seller's email address for payment. Strange, why would they want that? I've never had that. Anyway, must be something that their system has told them. So I said, you don't need to do that. I have got no idea. So, I said, okay, try this one. Etsy info, new order asks you to check your email. You should receive notification your item has been reserved. Please check your email. Let's have a look. Successful payment. Transaction instructions were sent to the seller's email address. Sorry, I have no idea what is going on. There's no asking for my card details to pay for it. <coughs> Let me show you what happened. Great news, your product sold. Good day, the customer has secured your item for purchase and is waiting your sales validation. Confirm your sale by clicking the button below and you will be navigated directly to your order confirmation page. Should you have any doubts, our chat support team is ready to assist you with the order confirmation page. Validate the deal. Okay. But the address is there. Etsy.safetest.y.top And it was this. Silver leaf ring. With 24 karat gold lining and CZ stone or plain, £29.40. The name of the person buying is that. So, I sent them a message. Can you please tell me why a customer has to enter my email address to make a purchase? And now it's asking me to validate her purchase by entering my card details. Because it's your first purchase, she says. You need to enter your card details to verify the payment method. I am the bloody seller, I said, and showed her the email screenshot. It's an anti-fraud check. This is standard procedure as of August the 15th, 2023. Check the confidentiality policy. I'm the seller, I replied. We know, but you need to verify your card to avoid further fraud so that we can establish your identity. Fuck that, close my shop. Okay, and that is when the alarm bells went. Etsy would never say, okay. You're not buying the product, they continued. I can't show you what I said after that, but now it's gone. That link has been invalidated, it's been taken down. So once again, that is the URL it directed me to. And that is a copy of the email I got. And that's the link I clicked when going to it. It no longer is available.